Hello guys, what's up? It's Asif here again. We know that the Sony A7R Mark IV is quite old. That camera announced on 16th July 2019. So it has been almost two years since we don't get any update of that particular camera. So we just can hope that we'll get the Sony A7 Mark V very soon but instead of that sony actually announced the sony a7r mark 4a and the sony a7r mark 3a so after that we thought that maybe in this year at least we will not get any update of that particular camera and we thought that maybe we get the update of that particular camera in the second or third quarter of 2022 but a chinese tech website just published the upcoming specification of the sony a7r mark V. now i doubted it because it is too early to understand or guess anything about that particular camera but let us first take a quick look about the rumored specification of the sony a7r mark V. this new camera will have a beyond xr image processor which will give a native iso of 80 to 32000 and can be boosted up to 40 to 81920 there will be a 61 megapixel xmor r sensor but we also getting the same 61 megapixel sensor in the current sony 7 r mark 4 so some technology will be updated but the megapixel count will be as same as it is there will be a 26 million pixel mode while you are shooting at aps-c mode there will be a 5.5 axis in built image stabilization there will be a 2.36 million pixel foldable lcd screen and double card slot this camera will have a 759 real time autofocus point now the term real time tracking autofocus is not accurate or just i don't like it you can say that it will have a 759 phase detection autofocus point that's okay actually it can able to focus on the eye of any birds animals and any other humans on the APS-C mode, it can deliver up to 10 FPS of continuous shooting. But on the full frame front, how many FPS we will get, it is not confirmed yet or not revealed yet by that Chinese source. We can say that 15 or 16 FPS will be enough at 61 megapixel because it will be a landscape and portrait or studio oriented camera there will be a 9.44 million pixel electronic viewfinder the best of its kind available on the market right now there will be a 10 bit hfia photo support for looseless compression of raw photos the shake mode has been updated to four types Two photos either four photos or eight photos or 16 photos there will be a support for 16 bit raw photos on the videographic fonts we can shoot full frame over sampled up to 4k 24p and 8k up to 24p there will be a super 35 for 4k 30p and 1.24x crop mode which can able to shoot at 4k up to 60p and slow motion video up to 240 fps at 1080p there will be nothing 120p slow motion at 4k the color depth will be 10 bit 4 to 2 to 2 over the hdmi and on the normal thing 
on screen you can shoot up to 10 bit close to 2 is to 0 there will not be any full size hdmi so micro hdmi will be available and the price point will be gbp 3800 or that will be the equivalent of 3500 us dollar so that's basically all about the rumor aspect of the sony a7 mark now, the first question is that, is it authentic? Can we really believe on this? I don't know. I'm just sharing it because I saw it. I thought that you should know about this. So, that's basically all. And let me know in the comment section below that, should this specification of the Sony A7R mark can be treated as authentic or just rumored specs? Let me know in the comment section below your valuable opinion and your choice sheet about the specification of this particular camera. I also want to know your guesses, what you actually want in the new Sony 7 r Mark V. So let me know in the comment section below. Until now, goodbye guys, have a nice day, see you on the next video.